Explore the world's most intriguing urban legends and mysterious creatures. Today we delve into the icy realm of the Himalayas to uncover the truth behind one of history's most infamous monsters, the Himalayas. A realm of perpetual ice and unforgiving peaks. But in this frozen wasteland lurks a terror that has haunted mankind for centuries. A beast of nightmares. They call it the Yeti. Standing up to 10 feet tall and weighing over 800 pounds, the Yeti is said to be a monster of unparalleled strength and savagery. Its body, a mass of corded muscle beneath a thick pelt of dark, matted fur. Witnesses describe a face that's unnervingly human-like, with deep-set eyes that glow with predatory intelligence. But it's not just the Yeti's appearance that strikes fear into the hearts of those who encounter it. It's the raw, primordial power it possesses. In 1998, Nepali forester Sonam Wangchuk reported a harrowing encounter. While on patrol near Makalu Barun National Park, he heard a blood-curdling roar that shook him to his core. The sound? It was like nothing I've ever heard, a scream of rage that could shatter stone. Then I saw it, a massive shape moving with impossible speed through the trees. In seconds, it had uprooted a fully grown pine and hurled it like a javelin. Wangchuk's account is far from unique. The annals of Yeti encounters are filled with tales of superhuman strength and bestial fury. If the Yeti exists, we're likely dealing with a highly adapted apex predator. Its reported strength suggests a musculature far denser than any known primate. And its speed, in that terrain, frankly, it's terrifying to contemplate. But it's not just the Yeti's physical capabilities that baffle researchers. It's the creature's apparent intelligence. Sightings span an area of over 500,000 square miles. Yet hard evidence remains frustratingly elusive. Some researchers suggest this points to a creature with near-human levels of cunning, a beast that understands it's being hunted. We've found structures, crude shelters, and even primitive tools that defy explanation, too advanced for known wildlife, yet clearly not human in origin. The implications are staggering. But perhaps most chilling are the accounts of the Yeti's hunting behavior. Unlike most predators, it doesn't just kill for food. Some reports suggest it kills for sport. In 2005, a group of climbers in Bhutan awoke to find their camp destroyed and two members missing. The only clues, massive footprints and a trail of blood leading into the icy darkness. Analysis of the site revealed something truly horrifying. The attack wasn't the work of a mindless beast, but a calculated predator that had systematically dismantled the climbers' defenses. As our understanding of the Yeti grows, so too does our terror. Is this simply an undiscovered species? Or are we dealing with something far more sinister? A creature that blurs the line between man and beast, predator and nightmare. One thing is certain, in the icy realm of the Himalayas, we are not the apex predator. Something ancient and terrible rules these peaks, and it's hungry.
space. 